Morning, we start with breaking news out of Darwin where three people have escaped from the Howard Springs COVID quarantine facility. Talia Saab is there for us. Talia, good morning. There's a search underway right now. Yes, that's right, Davina. Good morning to you. We've been told the trio scaled the fence in the early hours of this morning. Police receiving reports around 4.40 a.m. Now, major police checkpoints have been set up around Howard Springs for the past several hours. As you can see in these pictures, they've been conducting thorough searches in car boots, checking vehicle registrations, cars and buses alike. Hands. Are we the baddies? Well, friends, a little bit of a public service announcement, if you will, especially if you're on the continent of Australia, specifically the Catherine region. Watch out. Massive prison break. I'm talking a level 15 maximum security prison. Rapists, murderers, all types of people. Look at this fucking manhunt going on over here. They search in people's cars. They will find these people. Probably terrorists, by the way. Don't take cannibals. Cannibalistic terrorists. Not kid fuckers, though. They don't ever seem to get arrested in Western civilization. It's weird. It's almost like there's some sort of deep secret cabal of evil elites who traffic in sex with little children. Anyway, um, again, if you're in this region, watch out. Watch out for rampant criminals. Oh, I'm sorry. No, they're, they're not murderers. They're not rapists. No? It's uh, people with sniffs? Sniffles? Holy shit. You gotta be fucking kidding me. This is creepy. This is way creepy. Notice how the mainstream media press is never coming out. You don't have anybody coming out from the mainstream media press or any of these sports athletes, especially the basket hoops people who care so much about civil rights, right? All these people. Ain't nobody ever coming out and talking about the concentration fucking camps in China or the concentration fucking camps going on in Australia. How can anybody talking about this? Because that's the plan, boys. That's the plan for everybody. Nobody can come out and condemn this. Where's the UN at? What do you mean you're rounding people up? You're, you're rounding up Uyghur Muslims in China? Eh, we'll turn a blind eye to that. They're making Nike shoes for LeBron James over the fucking snitch bitch. And, uh, of course, you, you're rounding up people with a fever in Australia? Eh, you're gonna turn a blind eye to that too. Because, again, that's the fucking plan. Take a look at this. Then you got some people who break out of the fucking place, and now they way interested in looking for these people. Did they find any of those people from BLM and Antifa that burned down Sydney? Now, I'm normally, normally loath to criticize the police, but in this case, in Victoria, they've, they've ignored Extinction Rebellion effectively. They've ignored Black Lives Matter protests when I was there. There's Stop Adani graffiti everywhere. Did they find any of these people who are uh, setting shit on fire? And, no? No? All of the resources seemingly weird being devoted to it. Look, look at this fucking quarantine facility, by the way. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Does it say work will set you free right here on the way in? Look at the size of this motherfucking thing. Look at this. Holy shit. Never give up your guns, boys. Multiple people escaped from Howard Springs COVID-19 quarantine facility near Darwin. Re! Oh no, watch out, friends. This is over at abc.net.au. Northern Territory Police say multiple people escaped from Darwin's Howard Springs COVID-19 quarantine facility. You better fucking get them. You better get They might spread the fucking sniffles, boys. Holy shit, this is insane. A large number of police officers are currently at the scene. Officers in masks are searching vehicles in the area. Well, hold on a second. What, what do you mean? They're searching... Officers and masks are, are, are searching? So the masks work, right? Masks? So masks stop the coof. Because you've got cops over here in the magical masks. And they fucking going through the cars. Then what the fuck you need all this for then if masks work? That's weird. Staff at the facility are conducting a head count of those staying in the center. <laughs> Wait, look at this. Look at this. They're trying to make it sound like it's a fucking resort. Look, uh, you know, look at it. The, uh, the camp counselors, everybody, they're doing a head count for everybody who's staying in the center. No, no, they're not, they're not staying in the center. This isn't a fucking, they're not having motherfucking vacation over here. Because if you leave, oh, manhunt. <laughs> they got helicopters, boys. Solar-powered helicopters flying around looking for these coof criminals, boys. Look at this. Look, look, they're doing a head count for those staying. No, 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 they're doing a head count of the prisoners. In the center. They're prisoners. Because if they weren't prisoners, you wouldn't have a manhunt looking for them. They're fucking prisoners. Euphemisms. And you only need euphemisms when you have to fucking shenanigans, by the way. You mean shenanigans? 
The Howard Springs facility is currently holding people affected with the Northern Territory's Catherine Region COVID-19 outbreak as well as return travelers from repatriation flights. <laughs> Holy shit, you gotta go to prison if you fly back into this place? Canada's working up this energy too, boys. On Monday, authorities confirmed a case of the... Oh, not the fucking... The Omicron variant? Oh, no. Not the Omicron variant. In a man in his 30s who arrived on a repatriation flight from South Africa who is staying at the center. So you guys have the ability to test the different variants in the center? Is that a PCR test? How are you doing this? Do you guys got a genome sequencer in there? How is this working out? How Are you testing everybody for their variant? And science, 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 and science. The Catherine Region outbreak is the biggest the Northern Territory has faced so far with 58 people infected as of Tuesday. 50, 58, holy shit. 58 people infected? We better start setting up COVID concentration camps. By the way, I said, like, okay, well, how many people are in this region over here? You got 6,300 people over here. Okay, and that was 2016, so it's, it's up. So let's say you got, well, well, let's just stick with 63. Okay, so less than 1%? <laughs> holy shit. Less than 1%. And now we need a manhunt. Hey, if you're not being fucking nervous about this, you ain't paying attention. Less than 1%. Incident comes days after a 27-year-old man escaped the facility by scaling a fence and heading to the Mitchell Street party strip in a waiting vehicle. Police are still investigating the incident and searching for the driver involved. <laughs> now you're all in trouble. Look at this. How dare you help somebody leave this totally uh, fun time resort? No, 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 no. It's not a fun time resort. <laughs> now, you've, now you're going to be thrown in prison for helping somebody leave. A concentration. That's what this is. It's a concentration camp. It's a prison. It's a prison. There you have it, my friends. Multiple people escaped from Howard Springs concentration camp. COVID camp near Darwin. This is coming to everywhere if we don't stand up against this. You, you, you can't have it both ways. You can't tell me that masks work so the, the police are totally protected with the mask. You can't tell me that the uh, vaccine works. You can't tell me that all of this works and then on top of it go, oh yeah, by the way, we still need to you know set up concentration camps. So, something's not working then. Something, so, something's, not, so, something's going on then. There you have it, my friends. That's some absolute uh, Orwellian nightmare fuel for you. And the only way to fight this is to let people know that we see it. If we get enough people to start screaming, shouting, and pointing out this is happening, we can get this to fucking go back the other uh, the other way. Start shouting these people down. All right, guys. Thanks so much for watching the video. Support and check. We'll be kept up to date on these concentration camps. Hit that subscribe button and make way. Because the salt must flow.